Hi everyone, I hope you've had a fantastic week and here comes the weekend. Now, uh, I bought myself this cute little frock, it's a bit long and it's high necked as you can see. Now I wanted to do some styling for high necks and because um, I thought, you know, it's kind of obvious what you should do, but then I thought maybe it's not obvious. So of course with our range, there's many different things that we can do. So let's start. Now, what I would tend to do is, is definitely clear the neckline. You know who I am as far as um, not having jewelry finish on the neckline. And what I mean is this. So say for example, you've got your 10 way necklace and we take off the triple strand and we pop that on nice and high. Now. I'm not a huge fan. I think that the hemline's right there. You risk that some bits could fall underneath as you're moving and then you start to lose the, you know, the effect of it once you start to have pieces go missing underneath. The sure way to avoid this is to add another piece to the back of it to extend the length down a little bit. Even if you do it with half of our mini extender, so you know, these are sold in pairs and they're fantastic for adding just a bit more length. So even if you just added a mini connector, see how that's well and truly now past the neckline, you still have a lovely effect. And of course, what you can do is add different um, accessories to this if you want more of an extravagant look. So for example, or more of a detailed look, not necessarily extravagant. So you could go from as simple as, by the way, the dress is from Harlem and Stone. Everyone always asks me where I get my different bits and pieces from, and so that's where it's from. So I think it's just Australian though. See how you go. Um, so yeah, this uh, fantastic look, nice and elongated. Um, something long always adds to, um, what was I gonna say? Like a slimming kind of effect. Then you can also do things like, if you wanted to add a pendant to this effect, Again, I would go long. So for example, actually let's go with the mini connector while I've got it here. I'm styling with the Queen Freshwater Pearls. So there's that there. Now let's grab a pendant like an AB in the diamond, the large diamond. Okay, so there's that there, really, really nice. And once again, you can still layer on top by popping in Let's see how it looks with the connector. A regular connector added into the back. If you still wanted that layered look, there's that there, really, really lovely. So definitely clear the neckline. Then of course you can go quite long. So that's really easily done. So, because multi-lengths really is what this range is all about. And of course, ease of putting it on and putting it off. My daughter, bless her Kristen, you might, have seen her on different videos and this and that. They're all into their super fine jewelry. And I know every single time she's out there going, mom, can you help me with this? No, I want it on that one or that one. And you need help. You need a second person <laughs> to get you into those pieces. Now, this is the AB now lengthened one layer down, a whole, like a whole level down. It's just gone from here to here using the connectors. And what we can also do is things like pop in the Sister Sparkle uh, Pendant, this works exceptionally well as like a decorative medallion drop down. Um, it's really, really sweet. And that's just beautiful there. Now let's get a little bit creative as the Sparkle Sisterhood often do. Now the Sparkle Sisterhood is not necessarily a group that you have to be visible, you have to be commenting. It's a feel good group of women all around the world and we've come together and it's amazing what's been created. I really, even if you're thinking of, you're not sure about your next purchase or you just wanna have a bit of a laugh or, you know, it's really, it's good fun. You should join. We have 1700 women now from all over the world and I do three one hour lives a week. Yep, you heard me say it, three, okay. So here we have the tri-color satin in the link. Wow, this goes with everything. When I say everything, I mean everything. Not just in clothing, but also whether you choose to wear silver magnets, rose gold, or yellow gold magnets, it's gonna go with all of them because it has all three colors in it, so it's beautiful. So whether you then get a shorter triple strand, see this? Let's pop in. So what I've got here is now the cream pearl, and then that, and then the triple. Now what they off, what the girls have often done is then go in the reverse. 
So get a second link in the same color. And this is the standard length, this is the longer length in the necklace because we have bracelets to match and, um, let me have a little look. Bracelets to match and um, which are also in two longer lengths as well. So how cute is that? So then we're going longer, we're extending everything down and then the other lovely, lovely thing to do is to go reverse. So say for example, you've got the cream pearl strand here, the, which is just a touch of cream pearl. Then let's add the cream pearl connectors there. So we've gone reverse. So this appears at the bottom, this appears at the top. And then let's do this, shall we? This is gonna be quite cute. Let's put in a cream pearl pendant. So this is just one of many, many ways. And meanwhile, we didn't get onto, even get onto the tassel. Let's pour it out the tassel just in case, just for the sake of it. There we go. So whether you like to um, wear pendants and tassels together or whether you don't, it's completely up to you. Actually, I can't finish without showing you one more thing. Now, we also do a lot of connector styling. So what, what I mean by that is, let's say for example, what's a gorgeous color that's gonna go with this? Indian agate with khaki, um, khaki. Australians call sage khaki. And it took me a long time to stop saying khaki to the point where I now barely say it at all. So this is what I mean by connector styling. Let's pop in, so we've gone cream pearl, Indian agate connectors, then cream pearl there, and whether you choose to put a pendant at the bottom or add another combo or finish it off just like that, which is just so damn sweet. And then, as you know, the options are endless. Whether you want to, for example, layer a triple strand there above, like let it kind of hang above, or whether you want to get the triple, uh, the single strand, add it in. So again, what we're doing is we are going opposite. So up here, we've got the pearl single strand. Then the opposite is the, oh, look at that. They want to kiss, so that kind of will sit beautifully like that. Opposite is the pearl, then I've got a connector, 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 or add in a pendant. And let's just have a look at this length. Ah, uh, see, that's great because it well and truly clears the area, or, <laughs> this video will never end, actually. Or you can pop in minis in the opposite effect and go like that. And in fact, the kissing of the magnets will keep it all perfectly put together. So I hope this helps with some high neck styling. I might have to make a part two of this. See you soon.